Orthodox Church Cathedral in Prague and Warsaw. And I used to go into that and I was drawn to it every morning. Like I didn't, I'd get up in the morning, I didn't want to write. I would just want to go to the church. And I thought, am I going mad? Because I was there before. Like I was, yes, uh, yeah. you know, Catholic priest and all the rest. That's right. We wanted it? to, and we yeah. do what we want around here. It's such a great old song, and uh, it is for a lot of people. Uh -huh. Christmas starts when we hear fairy tale in New York. Yeah. Uh, right, it's 9.39, folks. Hi, everybody. So after nine. Vegan no. uh, hot chocolate has as much sugar as three cans of Coke. So this is, this is the story? This is the story. Okay, this is the story you're bringing us. Festive hot drinks at many coffee chains have become even more sugary due to the rise in vegan options, an alarming new international study has found. Some vegan drinks contain 23 teaspoons of sugar. What? Because they are made with pre-sweetened alternatives to cow's milk. Oh. The development has already led to an international outcry, and in Britain, campaign group Action on Sugar uh -huh. has found that the amount of sugar in festive coffees, many of which are sold here in Ireland, yeah. has soared since 2016, and they're blaming things like people are going for oat milk, yeah. milk. Yeah. Cans of Coke. It's scary. I didn't think so it was that much. You've got to be very, very careful, guys. Yeah. Like even looking at the calories and yeah. the sugar, like Starbucks, which we all love, but their signature caramel hot chocolate oh. oat milk yeah. drink. 758 calories. Really? Yeah. How many calories we let a day? I feel like it might be 1,500 or something. I think uh, for... Renault Cachard, proud sponsor of Christmas FM. You've just spent the past hour queuing in minus two degrees without a jacket, so your little angel can see Santa. You hope that smile on your daughter's face will be enough to keep you warm. Wasn't. And then you remember your Renault Kijar has heated leather seats. Look at that smile creeping back in. Have a warm and cozy Christmas in the Renault Kijar. The, the undercurrents of work, uh, I mean the pull toward nationalism on both sides of the Atlantic is, um, I think, part of what the disruption around Brexit is all about. And of course the election of Trump is part of that too. So there are strong undercurrents here that Ireland is going to have to navigate very carefully in the coming months. Okay, Billy Lawless is on the line as well. Of course, an uh, independent senator in Shannon Aaron, uh, representing the diaspora. Please donate what you can to Bernardo's.ie today to help us be there for every child that needs us this Christmas. Thank you. Sunshine Breakfast with Robbie Fogarty. Sunshine, 106.8. Clearing 
clarinet, we'd call it not dark net clarinet sight, where you wouldn't just look at the rating. Yeah, the site also has, uh, you can view other uh, users' reviews, so you can read the reviews and then you'll, you can take by looking at reviews, whether they're fake reviews or real reviews, by maybe how much price was for some. Shadow. 